Probably James Curtis, he's put his uh, head in where it hurts most times uh, during the session. Um, worked hard, so yeah, James Curtis. Um, I'd probably say Rob Ramshaw. Uh, <laughs> just gives the ball away quite a lot. Um, works hard, runs really fast, but um, just gives the ball away quite a lot, yeah. Mark Anderson. Sparky. He's very uh, technical. Doesn't hasn't got a lot, lot of chops or anything, but he's just really, really technical. Uh, Chris Mason. I don't want to say anything more. Probably. Well, Jimmy Chandler was quite hard last year. Um, I know he stitched us up in one of the games. He got sent off and cost us uh, two points. I think it was. Uh, but probably Dan Louse, not Chris Mason. I'm probably up there to be fair, me and James Curtis, I'd say. I suppose. Probably, I'd probably say Mark Anderson. It's worse because, I mean, it is good to be fair, but I mean, it's just too much sometimes. But the worst is probably AJ, because he's just boring. <laughs> Graham Armstrong. 100%. Very boring but very intelligent. It's got to be Rob Ramshaw. I think that's why he hasn't got a field job. <laughs> yeah, um, I think he's got property which is inherited, so it has to be Rob Ramshaw. <laughs> um, oh. <laughs> That's be Graham Armstrong. Um, I'd back that up by saying he came to Marbella in a, a West Ham United kit, like a bit of a West Ham United Aston Villa kit, but it didn't go down very well. There's quite a few jokers. Um, I'd say Ramshaw, um, Chandler, and Anderson. They're the, they're the three main jokers. Uh, Shane Henry, because they obviously he used to share a car with him and I think that's probably why I played most of the playoff winning season uh, <laughs> two years ago. Um, James Curtis. <laughs>